fish that can do that. Look at those teeth. Woo! Good job! Good job! Woohoo! Yeah! Oh, bro! Oh, the big day! Hey guys, what's up? Scott Lennox here. Welcome to another episode of Hooked on OC. We're right here every Sunday morning, 7 a.m. on, see if I get this right, Blake, WMDT 47 ABC. I think I just it. nailed it. it. So listen, the tall tog fishing in the back bays of Ocean City has gotten to be two thumbs up over the past couple of weeks. Um, and we've got tog jigs that we do really, really well with. We're gonna show you those in just a minute. Blake pours those and our thingamajig. So coming up after the break, we're gonna hit the back bays, maybe try a little rock fishing, but definitely gonna do some tog fishing. Stay tuned after the break, we'll be right back. Hooked on OC, we'll be right back. Storm has the area's largest selection of girls' clothing. 10,000 square feet of girls' surfwear, featuring Billabong, Roxy, Volcom, O'Neill, and Ruka, and swimwear by L-Space and Magi, and many more. By far the largest selection of girls' surfwear that you need to be seen in this summer. Quiet Storm Surf Shop Boardwalk at North Division Street, right next to the Ocean City Arch. Ocean City is looking for people with experience, people with ambition, people who entertain new ideas and explore new paths, working in tandem for a common goal, people who love life and think different. Explore the possibilities. Ocean City welcomes you. Find your calling at ococean.com slash calling. Sunset Marina is Ocean City's premier full-service marina resort. Sunset Marina is located just five minutes from the Ocean City beach and boardwalk. Sunset's charter fleet boasts the finest fleet of sport fishing boats in the mid-Atlantic, all operated by Coast Guard licensed captains. One look at Sunset's amenities and you're hooked for good. Contact Sunset Marina today to book your fishing charter. Call 1-877-514-FISH. And now back for more Hooked on OC. All right, dude. Glad to be with you again. Definitely, man. Glad to be with you again. I see you every couple of weeks, man, as we get thingamajigs and, and tog jigs. Um, you're ready for the shops and stuff like that. Doing a great job, by the way. Thank you very much. People are catching fish. Uh, we've done some videos. The last TV show that we did, John Ben and I went up to the Route 90 Bridge. And, and like, I won't say smoked, but we lit the rockfish pretty good nice. uh, on that thingamajig. And that new color is doing really, really well. Before we get started tog fishing today, a uh, little announcement to make. So, guess who caught the first flounder in Ocean City this, this season? <laughs> I did! <laughs> I did, it was pretty awesome. Kristen and I went for a trip. Um, we were really, literally just gonna go try for a little while. It was super windy. I didn't expect to be uh, you know, catching a flounder, but I did. April 3rd, uh, caught it on the, the deadly double uh, in chartreuse for the third year out of four years that, fit, that fish has been caught on a deadly double chartreuse with a white gulp. And Kristen was lucky enough to have her phone in her pocket, pulled it out, so got a pretty funny video. Check it out. Wow, 
Sunday, April 3rd. Look at the water out there. There are white caps and we're out here fishing. Look at this man. Holy smoke. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. I've been in Ocean City for 30 years. I've never caught the first flounder of the season in my life. Oh, All right, put it on the look measuring tape. Let's look. Don't drop it over. Check it out. So three out of the last four years now. I'm gonna get closer. Chartreuse, the chartreuse deadly double, and a white gulp. That fish is legal. Watch. <laughs> <laughs> it is so windy today. Oh my gosh. 18. <laughs> All right, so that was, that was pretty fun, man. I'm getting a lot of comments about uh, that video and how excited I was, but you know me well enough now. Yeah, that, yeah. That, that was me, man. I was jacked up on that. Uh, first time in 30 years I've been fishing in Ocean City to catch the first flounder of the season, so I'm pretty, pretty excited about that. Today, different story, man. We're going tog fishing, um, and you do really good at this. You're one of the first people out here in the spring catching tog. Uh, what do you want to try today? Where, where you want? I, you know, we're going to use green crabs. We're going to use some shrimp. Yep. Um, what, what spots you want to try? We have a couple hit? spots with so the incoming tide. We might try South Jetty. Okay. And then we have some time with the tide change. We might try some rockfish. Yeah, it's been good. it's been good at Route 90. We'll yeah. try Route 50 maybe. Yeah. See what's up down here. I know just Big Bird just passed us a little bit ago. He's going fishing, yeah. uh, so some fish might be showing up. And then the hot spot for you has been probably end up at Martha's Landing okay. this time of year with yeah. the water warming up with the outgoing tide. Okay. But uh, you, you know it can be really really good. We're going to be using these again today. This is the Fishing OC Tog Jig. Uh, there's a couple of them right there. They come in two colors. They come in white crab and they come in green crab. Blake pours these for us along with the thingamajig heads. Does a great job. Even puts that orange on the bottom to kind of simulate an egg sack on the bottom of these. They come in five sizes. Uh, they come in three quarter, one ounce, one and a half ounce, two ounce, and three ounce. So if you're fishing back here in their bay, you're going to use something between three quarter, maybe maybe ounce and a half. Um, and if you're fishing out in the ocean, you're going to be more like two, three ounces. You have to use much more than three ounces. That's getting a little bit too much, and most of the time people just switch over to using top and bottom rigs, uh, like our double header rig, for instance, for catching tall, because that current gets moving too fast, and it just gets really tough to catch them. So we, you got you stole her uh, shrimp scampi again. I did. <laughs> Sorry to blow, your, my wife sorry shrimp, to blow but... your cover. But we're going to try and yep. replace that with Some... fresh tall tall. Yep. All right, so Missy, thanks a bunch for the shrimp. Um, let's give us a shot, yeah, see what happens, brother. Dead. All right, cool. man. Thanks for waiting, small guy. <laughs> Please identify it. <laughs> See if you can tell me. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's a pollock, brother. I think so too. I, I don't know if I've ever heard of that in the inlet. A cock, a We're going to find out. I'm pretty sure that's a pollock. Hmm. Not the intended species, but what? I don't know what the uh, I don't know what the limit on those is. I don't think. Good job putting it back. Thank you. Um, yeah, look. This is rare. This is rare. I got to go to Google, but um, that's just because we're tog fishing, and that wasn't a tog, <laughs> first of all. Uh, and I'm pretty sure that that was this guy. Am I wrong? Yeah. Yep. And I've never caught one in the. Never inlet. heard of one in the Ocean City Inlet. And we went and, and, and took a quick Google just to confirm, but Blake just caught himself a Pollock inside the Ocean City Inlet in 30 feet of water. And the water temperatures low 50s. Um, yep. Here's what we do. Mm. It was fun. That was an awesome fight. It did. <laughs> you know what? That's what Forrest Gump's mother should have said. Yeah. You know, life is like the Ocean City Inlet. It is. Dude. You, you never, never know, know what you're gonna get. Dude, I've caught lawn chairs, fishing rods. <laughs> I caught a fishing rod not too far from here, an old Mitchell 300. All right. And. 
On one end was the Mitchell 300 with a rod, and on yeah. the other end Crook. was a three pound flounder. Oh, damn. Hooked on OC, we'll be right back. Top Dog Services has the largest fleet of snow removal equipment in all of North America. With several sizes of tree can snow melters, no job is too large. Top Dog's fleet is ready to mobilize to clear and melt snow on site at any college, stadium, hospital, shopping mall, or other large scale facility. Top Dog Services currently provides snow removal and melting services for Dulles International, Reagan National, the U.S. Pentagon, and many others. Watch your winter worries go down the drain. Call Top Dog Services for 24 hour emergency snow response. Hi, it's Todd from Park Place Jewelers. We would love to help you celebrate all those special moments and occasions in your life. A new engagement, or an anniversary celebration, an incredible accomplishment, a cherished moment, a lifelong memory, landmark occasions, or a treat yourself present. So let Park Place Jewelers put a sparkle in your life with a gift of fine jewelry. Welcome to Monogram Furniture. We've got your style and budget in mind with two locations in West Ocean City and Fenwick Island. Coastal, modern, contemporary, or casual, our knowledgeable design team will make your house into a home with the personal touches that set Monogram Furniture above the rest. Get the wow factor for your home at a price that can't be beaten. 12 months, 0% financing now available. We've also got your windows and doors covered with our custom blinds, shades, and shutters. Discover your style. Discover Monogram today. Improve your vision. Improve your life. Call now to schedule your exam appointment or bring your prescription in today. An Optical Galleria is the creator of Hook Optics, the hottest new brand of polarized sunglasses made to handle the most demanding environments. This award-winning practice has three convenient locations, West Ocean City, Centerville, and Easton, on the web at eyesandart.net and hookoptics.com. Atlantic Tackle, we know fishing. Atlantic Tackle is the Mid-Atlantic's most complete tackle store, showcasing a huge selection of rods and reels, bait and tackle, fishing apparel, eyewear, and ocean-inspired home decor from industry leaders like Penn, Shimano, Bait Masters, Costa, Smith Optics, Pelagic, Hook, Olakai, Extra Tough, and Yeti. Stop by Atlantic Tackle on Sunset Avenue across from Sunset Grill in West Ocean City or visit us online at AtlanticTackle.com. And now, back for more Hooked on OC. Oh, it's got whack. Oh, you got him. I saw you moving around a little bit. You feel like a little better one? Yep. You need a nick? Um, this is a light rod. Where is it? Um, right species. We can flip her in. Yeah, man. All right. Nice little female. Blake, you know the scientific name of Paul Paul? I don't. You know the scientific name for Tal -tal? Tal -tal. Let's introduce folks to Tautalga Oneidas. Jim Crawl would be real proud of me right now. Tautalga Oneidas. A lot of you guys up, not all, a lot of you guys, all you guys up north call them blackfish. Uh, you can see why. Real dark color to them. Blake's releasing it just like you, you want to. You don't want to get anywhere near the mouth with your thumb because the teeth in there, they're not sharp, Barry. You know, they're not real sharp, but they are kind of gnarly. Um, you don't want to go messing around there. It's very small mouth anyway. Um, and with these jigs that we're using, which we'll get a little bit more in detail about in a little bit, uh, you don't need to get too close to their mouth. They pop right out. Yeah. There we go again. <laughs> Look, it's gone. That's weird, man. When you feel it and it's in his, feel it in his face and it comes off, that means it was just barely hooked, man, because a tog's mouth is so rubbery, uh, it should get set in there pretty good. And these hooks are so sharp, there's no way it's not getting buried in there. So it must have just been a piece like this and boop. But you drop it down again and you wait for another one. There we go. Yeah, baby. Got him that time. Uh, I don't think so. I'm on the board. On the board. There, there she is. We'll show you the difference between a female and a male in just a little bit, but remember this. Dark colored like this with no spot, that's a female. Uh, that fish is probably gonna go know, 12 inches or so. We're looking at a 16 inch limit, size limit wise. Um, but a beautiful, beautiful tall tog. Really, really delicious eating fish. 
Um, we'll do one of these. Watch this. I'm going to give them a third fin rip like Monty Hawkins. That way, this fish, that fish is not tagged necessarily, but if it comes up and that scar is over, we'll be able to tell if we caught that fish before. Third fin rip thanks to Captain Monty Hawkins. You guys saw an entire show on this last time where we were up here at the Route 90 bridge. Not much going on down at the Route 50 bridge. Water was a little bit colder and the tide was ripping through there. So we decided to come up here to Route 90 bridge where it's been pretty consistent. And there we are, Rocky Balboa. There's plenty of them up here, folks. Blake pours our thingamajig for us. We get the tails from another local guy that's doing them all custom for us uh, at Old School Tackle. And that combination right there is called the thingamajig. That one has been through the ringer. He's even losing an eye. Unless you didn't put it on there. One of your kids got it on his, his milk, might, his milk jug might. or his lunchbox. <laughs> but there it is, thingamajigs. Uh, red head with the salt and pepper body and that chartreuse tip tail has been, been doing really, really well. Um, and Atlantic Tackle has got a whole bunch of them now in stock. Just dropped them off. Let's catch another one. Swimming at me. Man, are these fun, fun fish to catch. Say it again, you ain't gonna catch a keeper. But, catch these little 15, 18, sometimes up to 22 inches or so up here. And a keeper wouldn't shock me, but I would be really, really surprised. There he is, Maryland State fish. Beautiful, beautiful rockfish. Nice and healthy. What do you think he's saying right now? Yo, Adrian! Thingamajig is on fire! Damn. Yeah, buddy. Two in a row! Right. I think you gotta have a one-eyed thingamajig right now. Dude. They want the one with the, with the damaged face. <laughs> All right, Scott got four. I can take off my hook protector. <laughs> oh, sweet. Head start. Thank you, Blake. That's still better. Yeah, that's a little better. I like it. Yeah. That's starting to get Daddy. a little belly on him. That's nice. Nice, man. That was two casts in a row. Did you even stop recording there, John Ben? <laughs> yes. Oh. That's okay, man. You can't catch a fish. Catch me. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> These feel like rockfish, only smaller. But don't your kids love doing this, man? Don't your kids love coming up here and doing this? So much fun. Even if they don't know how to cast, you can always cast it out there, hook them up, and hand them the rod, man. It's a, it's a blast. That fish, like, if he was a times two, he might be close to legal, but not this time. Hooked on OC. We'll be right back. We catch a lot of fish here at Hooked On OC, and my JPR custom rods are nothing but the best. Some of the finest inshore, offshore, casting, spinning, and trolling rods on the planet today. Custom rods, custom logos, all at unbeatable prices. Go to JPRRods.com. Midshore Electronics offers a team of Garmin factory trained technicians that are ready for any marine electronics installation, modification, or repair. No project is too small. With locations in Cambridge and Ocean City, Midshore is Delmarva's only Garmin service center. Midshore provides the most innovative marine electronic solutions available, and our work has been voted best on the bay for over 20 years. Visit our website, stop by, or call us today. Hey guys, what's up? I'm here with Luke and Laura from Sandmarks Marketing. Brand new book out this summer. Luke, tell me about it. 
Thank you, Scott. Destination Ocean City and Delaware Beaches has all the fun, cool family stuff, including dining, shopping, attractions, golf, and surfing. Don't forget fishing. <laughs> that's fishing awesome. Too, that's awesome. Scott. And you can find it all around town, I guess. You can. Look in your hotel room. Look for the beach chair. And you'll be there. Tipsy Tiki is a floating tiki bar, the only one in the Ocean City area that is Coast Guard certified for 12 passengers with a Maryland State liquor license. Great for bachelor, bachelorette parties, and birthdays, anniversaries. Enjoy a calm cruise in the backwaters behind Assateague Island in Ocean City. The cost is $70 per person, which includes a 90-minute cruise and full bar service. You can bring your own food or you can call Crab Alley for carryout. Check us out at Facebook or our website at tipsytiki.com. Call 443-606-0822. Our friendly crew is ready to welcome you aboard. And now, back for more Hooked on OC. Yeah! That's probably the best one of the day, man. Nice fish. Hooked right in the corner of the mouth. Thingamajig doing its trick. I think it's more silver than red right now, but that tail's doing a lot of action. Blake and I were talking just a second ago about how you can feel that thing back there working. It's spinning in that current, just flipping around like that. These things are loving it. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> the two in a row again cast. Oh, he's peeling drag. Yeah. Oh, we're doubled up, yeah! Yeah, I'm here. Nice. Yeah, I'm coming to you, John. Look, double, double hook up, double release. There we are. Way to go, bro. The fish yeah. high five. Yeah. And we're having a blast right now up at the Route 90 Bridge, catching and releasing these rockfish with thingamajigs. But we're only going to show you this for a couple of minutes because this is a tog fishing show and we're going right back to it in just a second. Yeah, buddy. Hardest rock fish I've ever worked for in my life. <laughs> Blake to a room. Oh, his friend was swimming with him. They're starting to chew now. Man. Oh, man, he's pulling drag. Let it be catch and release. That's oh, what we do. We'll see if we see if we get another one on. Oh, hit it. And he's on! And he didn't cut. Yes, sir. Let's see if we can go for three in a row. Three in a row! The crazy thing is I probably did a hundred casts without a bite. And then the last three casts I got a fish. And we're doubled up. We're doubled up again. One in. Two in. I feel like Big Bird Cropper right now. <laughs> yeah, man. So much fun. So much fun. That was a good hit.
I had to get in that piling before Scott threw it there. Get this fish out of the way for him. Hooked on OC, we'll be right back. For over 40 years, the Dough Roller has been an Ocean City tradition. Serving award-winning fresh dough pizza and our signature buttermilk pancakes served all day. Visit our website for menus, location details, and hours. Featuring the finest and largest fleet of charter boats in the Mid-Atlantic region, the Ocean City Fishing Center has been the premier spot for offshore sports fishing for four decades. Whether it's a family outing, a corporate event, or just a day on the water with your friends. All our charters are led by Coast Guard licensed captains and boast knowledgeable crews dedicated to helping you catch the big one. Call us today and book your charter. We accommodate groups of all sizes. The Ocean City Fishing Center. The locals know it's the best place to go. Hey everybody, looking for what's going on in and around Ocean City? Pick up the dispatch. 25,000 copies in over 200 locations all around Delmarva and the Fishing OC Fishing Report by yours truly with pictures from Dave Messick and some of the best captains in the biz. Pick it up. Racetrack Marine, the area's premier Tidewater center console and Sylvan pontoon boat dealer. In stock or custom order Tidewater starting at 18 feet and Sylvan pontoons up to 27 feet. Service, maintenance, and trailers. Find it all here at Racetrack Marine. We buy, broker, and sell pre-owned boats too. Deep discounts and the best stem to stern warranty available. Say goodbye to last year's boat repairs. Stop dreaming and start boating today. Racetrack Marine, the place that does it all. 6G. Network, 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 network. We've had Arizona for over six years. In the beginning, we knew that this was going to make a difference, but we didn't realize how big of a difference it was going to make. I think our staff enjoy being able to have that option to sanitize their classroom. We actually didn't realize exactly how many people would enroll in our school just because we had a zone. So just the fact that they know that we're doing everything we can to make sure we're cutting out those germs in the classroom. That is what's best for the kids. And now back for more Hooked on OC. There you are. Nice one, Scott. You like that? Uh, I don't know. I so. There she is. First drop. Little rock fishing up the Route 90 bridge. That was fun and productive. First stop here, Blake's favorite tog hole, and there's one in the boot. Ago we showed you a female. Now we'll show. Ooh, there's one sure sign that he's a male. <laughs> but what you saw a little while ago with that female, dark colored skin. You can see he's dark on top, but he's a little bit lighter on the bottom, right? And then that giveaway right there, not so distinguishable on this side, but over on this side, really noticeable white spot. Most males will have that white spot. Two drops, two fish. Yeah. 
Yep. Tide's changing, starting to get a few bites. Give her a look, it's gonna be close. Fifteen and a half. Yes, we guarantee it's fifteen and a half. This hook's going in and out of there so easy. Where's your measuring stick there, Blake? All right, we're looking for 16 inches. So nose up at the zero, down to the, hey, 15 and a half. Oh, man. Gotcha. No big deal here either. It's three to four, must be. Must be like a lot of ladies down there. It's three females to one male. I won't complain about that right now because I'll wait for a keeper and at least she's not all over my black jacket. I don't know if it was on camera or not when Blake said a little while ago that when they pick you up, that's a really good fish. And I just not only had one pick me up, it picked me up and moved the rock. I could see my line move and I went to set the hook and just barely felt him and missed him. Same hole too, man. He picked me off twice in there. I don't think so. Yeah, I think it was in a rock. She was literally in those rocks. I think John John was proud of himself, my cameraman John. John, nice work. John was proud of himself. Oh yeah, I just turned around to see you miss that fish. Way to go. It's good, good for you. Be sure to put a raise in your next next check. But I got her. Same bite. It seemed probably the same fish. She was laying down in that exact same hole. I put it off the same spot on the back of the boat. Uh, and sure enough, came back and ate it again. But I got her that time. Choo. Yeah, that's what happens. So we're down there fishing this structure so much, and they've got some pretty good teeth on a tog. You, I didn't check it as much as I should have. So my my leader must have gotten compromised down here toward the bottom, and I went to set the hook on that fish, and shh, pow, lost it. So let's tie another one. Fun fishing. I think that's the smallest one I've caught. Maybe the first one was about that small, but little female. Perfect. Hooked on OC. We'll be right back. One of the shore's best kept secrets is a secret no more. Ocean Pines Golf and Country Club is home to the only Robert Trent Jones Senior Championship Golf Course on the Eastern Shore. Ocean Pines is set amongst natural wetlands and scenic woodlands, making it a must play. Experience golf as it was meant to be played. Call 410-641-6057 or visit us online at oceanpinesgolf.org to book your tee time today. Operating since 1982, Arctic Heating and Air Conditioning is the number one company for keeping homes comfortable and families happy. We are expanding our services beyond heating and air conditioning to full residential electrical services such as circuit breaker panel changeouts and assessments, ceiling and bath fans, recessed lighting, smoke detectors, smart home upgrades, video doorbells, surveillance cameras and more. Do you need any of these services for your home? Give us a call. If you can't, we can. Arctic Heating and Air Conditioning.
Are you looking for the best crabs on this side of the Chesapeake Bay? Then head on over to Crabs to Go on the corner of Route 50 and 589. For over 20 years, Crabs to Go has been bringing you the fattest, tastiest crabs on the eastern shore available by the bushel or by the dozen. We also offer a full menu including shrimp, clams, oysters, scallops, lobster tails, crab meat, and soft crabs. Call ahead for fast, hot carryout. Or stop by for our homemade crab cakes, soups, and salads. This is where the locals come. Crabs to Go, Routes 50 and 589, West Ocean City. Don't just visit the beach, make it your home. Live the coastal lifestyle. Live by the water. Live by the catch. Live by the coastal culture. Live by your own rules. You have the right to choose your title company. Eastern Title is here to ensure that your coastal property is the right fit. We're here to simplify the transition from your favorite getaway into your new staycation home. Eastern Title. We close anywhere, anytime. And now back for more Hooked on OC. Yeah, that might be one. Let's check. That was a little bit better bite. Another male. You guys might be starting to notice the difference. See his his white spots, very very uh, not noticeable. That's not. Is that even a word? Not notice. Very not noticeable. I'll use it. A little bit right there. A little bit on this side. Looking for 16 inches. 16 inches. And these fishing OTC tall jigs are doing the trick, man. All right, let's get out of there. Cough it up, homie. 16, Blake, think he's 15 and a half, too? Uh, I think he'll do it. Nose to the end of the board. He's gonna do it close. Man, we're listening, we, look. We're gonna appease the fish gods here. Yep. That ain't there. Not there. 15 and three quarters on this one. 15, 15 and three quarters, quarter inch bigger than the last one that was close. I think we're almost there. 16 inches right around the corner. There's a fish. Yep, and a fish in it. Give me a good bite. I gotta check this bait. I think I got snook without, uh, without even getting a good bite out of it. Pretty teeny tiny. Not as teeny tiny as Blake's, but teeny tiny. And look how sharp those hooks are, man. They go in and out of the fish really, really easily. And Blake's making them, doing an outstanding job for us. Tackle shops are selling them like hotcakes. Uh, they're also available on our website, fishingoc.com. And people are catching fish on them. That's the most important thing. Right now, bro. Scott is on fire. Psst. I mean, I think that's a dozen or something. Dude, it is, man. You're from the same hole. Keep going. Yeah. Hooked on OC. We'll be right back. It's beyond the gun. It's the brain before the bullet. It's not you doing a drill, it's you mastering a skill that could save your life. Fortress Training trains both beginners and advanced shooters on the skill of carrying a firearm and is unlike any other training. Fortress Training has helped over 2,000 people successfully obtain a Maryland wear and carry permit. If you qualify, we can help. Public, private, and corporate events for training are also available. Train at the next level. Train with Fortress Training. 
Just what exactly does Okaya mean? Okaya means strength. Okaya means dependability. Okaya means value. Okaya means fishing. Check out the full line of Okaya rods, reels, and accessories at okaya.com and find out for yourself why thousands of customers around the world rely on Okaya fishing equipment. Because Okaya means business. The tradition continues as Jolly Roger at the Pier opens this Easter weekend, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday at noon. Rides, games, and plenty of fun. Get a free picture taken with the Easter Bunny Friday from 2 to 4 or Saturday and Sunday from noon to 2 and get a special Easter present for all the kids, too. Bring the whole family for a weekend of fun as we celebrate Easter and the opening of Jolly Roger at the Pier. And now back for more Hooked on OC. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the show. Welcome to the Angler's Advantage here at Atlantic Tackle in West Ocean City. Got a beautiful day right now. Um, thank you for tuning into this episode of the show. We're having some fun catching tall tog, catching some rockfish and that sort of thing. Atlantic Tackle here is all geared up, guys. They've got green crabs in stock. They've got minnows in stock and more live bait coming all the time. Sand fleas will be here anytime now. Come on in here and stop in and get some bait, get these rigs I'm about to tell you about. So we're doing some tog fishing, doing a little bit of rock fishing. We'll do the rock fishing stuff first. So we're up at the Route 90 bridge. Fish are being caught down at the Verrazano bridge. We've got fish being caught at the Route 50 bridge, but the Route 90 bridge is the hot spot right now. People catching anywhere from just a couple of fish, you know, on, on a tough day, to 30, 40 fish on a really good day. Not too many keepers up there, but there are quite a few fish there. You can go up there with the kids and have an absolute blast. What are we using? We're using the Fishing OC Thingamajig. Thingamajig is a half ounce lead. It's got two tails in each package. So you actually get three choices of baits. If you happen to fish this with bluefish now at the Route 50 bridge or the Ocean City Inlet, bluefish bites that tail off. You got two replacements in there. Comes in three different styles. You got the white, white head glows. That comes with a white rigged. And then you got green and ghost on there as replacements. Option number two, it also glows. This is the green head and comes with a white replacement and a dark replacement, all right? And then the one we're using today, Blake and I are absolutely killing these fish today. This is the new one. This is the candy red salt and pepper shad body with a chartreuse tail. And all three of these um, are custom made here on the Eastern shore, both the head and the tail, custom made here on the Eastern shore by a couple of guys doing a great job for us. And I guarantee you it's got something to do with the wobble of that tail that gets these fish all excited. Um, you can see Blake and I are getting a couple two in a row, three in a row, double hookups and that sort of thing. When those fish are there, they cannot stay away from this thing. So there it is, the fishing OC thingamajig here at Atlantic Tackle. Now we're also doing some tog fishing, doing more tog fishing than rock fishing. Basically the rock fishing, that was to kill a little bit of time while the tide was switching downtown there at the Ocean City Inlet around Martha's Landing area, that sort of thing. Couple of different tog rig options here at Atlantic Tackle. One is from SNS Tackle. Um, SNS Bucktails, they make a couple of different styles, different colors. Orange here, glow here. They've even come out with one that's a sheep's head, a sheep's head jig, and that's got a little bit different hook in it. So you'll find the Mustad hooks in these, and then you're gonna find an owner hook in these one packs. Right now, they're right across from the counter here at Atlantic Tackle. And then we're using, with the manufacturer himself, the Fishing OC Tog Jig. Man, these things have been on fire. Folks sending us pictures and emails and Facebook messages, Instagram tags, all that sort of stuff on these Fishing OC Tog Jigs. I don't see anything out there like these. I was in New Jersey a couple of months ago for a trade show, and those guys are blackfish killers. They love fishing for them blackfish, you know what I'm saying? And they love using jigs. So when we were up there, we had these jigs on display, selling a couple of them, and they absolutely loved them. So coming from the place where these all started, um, and guys that fish them all the time to get those kind of accolades, we're really, really proud of that. Over here at Atlantic Tackle, they've got five different sizes from us. Actually, they have everything that we carry. Three quarter all the way to three ounce. So we've got three quarter, one ounce, 
one and a half, two, and three. So your bay fishing is gonna be anywhere between the three quarter and the one and a half. If you have to fish two ounces back in the bay, that current's probably moving a little bit too fast. Ocean fishing, you're gonna want two and three ounce. Had a little bit of a request for four, but most guys, when they have to fish more than three ounces in the ocean, they are gonna be fishing uh, rigs. They're gonna use something like our double header rig, uh, or just tie their own rigs with top and bottom, that sort of thing. But once the current gets moving too fast, jigs are not in the equation anymore. You go to rigs. Back here in the bay, that rarely happens. So Martha's Landing, Route 50 Bridge, South Jetty, North Jetty, uh, sometimes it's on the bulkhead behind Ocean City. You're gonna have a lot of luck with these jigs. And if you haven't used one yet, you have to try one. They are really, really effective. Really easy to fish too. You basically drop it down on the bottom, you put a bait on the end of the hook and you just wait for a bite like you would with the rig, but you don't get snagged as much. Uh, you don't lose as many sinkers and gear uh, because a lot of times what happens is the sinker will go down in a hole in the rocks and get snagged, you lose everything. The jig sits just perfectly on top of whatever structure it lands on. And as you can see, whenever it falls, it sits absolutely perfectly every time you drop it. When you're lowering it down with line, it's real simple. You're really gonna just lower it down like this. And as soon as it hits the bottom, it's gonna sit upright like that. Your bait is gonna be presented perfectly up top. Blake and I are using shrimp and green crabs today. More sand fleas show up. We'll start to use sand fleas. We'll be switching over to this white one. That white looks just like a sand flea or a white crab. White leggers, a lot of these guys will call them. And this green looks just like a green crab. Even got the egg sack on the bottom and it blends in perfectly with the rocks here in the back bays of Ocean City. So there you go. This is what we're using today. Thingamajigs at the Route 90 bridge catching these rockfish. Tog jigs at the Martha's Landing spot and at the North Jetty and South Jetty for the tog. Awesome time, having a great time. We're hoping you're enjoying the show. Get over here to Atlantic Tackle in West Ocean City, right across the street from Sunset Grill and Sunset Marina, 410-213-0421. Give you a little sneak peek about what we'll be talking sometime in the near future. First flounder of the season on the Chartreuse Deadly Double. See you in a second. Hooked on OC, we'll be right back. At Spencer Yachts, your dreams can become a reality in a sport fishing yacht unequaled in style, performance, and value. Spencer Yachts has taken the Carolina style of boat building and transformed it into a world-class, high-performance sport fishing yacht. Spencer Yachts Brokerage is Spencer Yachts' in-house trusted yacht broker with extensive market knowledge. New to Spencer Yachts Brokerage is the beautiful 77-foot Jarrett Bay Boatworks sport fish, Mama Who. Check out Mama Who and all that Spencer Yachts Brokerage has to offer at SpencerYachtsInc.com. AquaTraction Custom Design Marine Flooring Products have exceptional traction wet or dry, making your boat safer, cleaner, and more comfortable. AquaTraction Flooring is durable, stain resistant, and backed with 3M adhesive specifically designed to withstand the harshest marine environments. With 23 nationwide reps, AquaTraction has an unmatched 3-year warranty, provides the fastest turnaround time, and has unparalleled customer service. Check out AquaTraction.com to find out why I've got it in my boat and how it's charter proven all around the country. Sunset Provisions is Delmarva's largest marine supply retailer, stocking an unmatched selection of pumps, paints, hoses, cosmetic care products, and marine hardware. Featuring the absolute best brands in the industry, combine this unbelievable in-stock selection of top-name brands with super competitive pricing and a seasoned staff that can help you navigate your project. Make Sunset Provisions Delmarva's go-to marine supply store. So stop by or call today and see for yourself what makes Sunset Provisions the area's best marine supply store. Sunset Provisions is located in West Ocean City at Sunset Marina. PYY Marine is the Mid-Atlantic's choice for Yellowfin, Cape Horn, and Solus boats and is an authorized factory-trained sales and service center for Yamaha, Mercury, and Suzuki engines. PYY Marine in Pasadena, Maryland offers affordable slips and the gated facility offers 24-hour surveillance for worry-free storage. Whether it's education, service, slips, sales, or storage, our goal is to make boating easy and fun. Give our experienced crew a call and let our customer service speak for itself. Why PYY Marine? Why not? And now back for more Hooked on OC. Hey, quick. Uh. Hey, you got him that time. Yeah, I did. I feel like a good one. Yep. A little better. That's not stuck. Nope. Oh, that's grinding, brother. Keeper time. Uh, I don't know. Close. Come on, get him. She was fighting, but man, she wasn't going anywhere. Nope. Baby. 
be the greenie. Oh, oh my. <laughs> it's gonna be close. We're gonna see. Dude, that's our keeper. Yeah. We're gonna we're gonna use a couple a couple tape measures. That's, if you measure on four different tape measures, that means it's good. Dude, I think he is. We're doing one more here. Let me give you a second set of, set of eyes on it. So that's on the Keep far. Keep that fish. Look on the far side of that mark. Far side of that mark. Keep that fish. That's that's street legal. Yep. Here comes the man. You might check with him. Say, hey, look, you can check. This fish is still alive. Yeah. Hooked on OC. We'll be right back. How much protection from the beach would you need to match the Arctic Air Coastal Series air conditioner? Still not enough. Arctic Air Coastal Series. Built for the beach. Top Dog Services is built on an essential response attitude and has been serving the entire East Coast since 1994. In these uncertain times, we understand our customers' need for an immediately safe environment. Top Dog is now specializing in electrostatic cleaning as well as full commercial janitorial services for clients that include the U.S. Pentagon. We have crews ready to efficiently and proactively address and clean confirmed COVID-19 areas to allow a safe return to the space at the earliest convenience. Give Top Dog Services a call to find out why our motto stands strong. Lean on experience, adapt to new ideas. Red Sun Custom Apparel opened for business in Ocean City, Maryland with the mission of providing total customer satisfaction. Our philosophy is simple. Offer a wide selection of leading products at competitive prices and provide high quality customer service seven days a week. Our customers place orders with confidence knowing they will be completed on time and accurate according to the high standards Red Sun Custom has quickly become known for. Call us today for all of your promotional needs. You don't buy an ordinary chair for the beach, so why would you buy an ordinary air conditioner for the beach? Arctic Air Coastal Series, built for the beach. And now back for more Hooked on OC. It's work, brother. Dude, it was fun. How about that, Missy? He, he traded you shrimp for tall talk. I don't know if that's a good trade or not. It's a good trade. <laughs> it's a real good trade. Especially the recipe you told me when we weren't we weren't uh, on camera. Yeah, that's a great dig, man. It's good stuff. So good fishing, dude. Yeah, yeah, it's, man. That's good fishing. I mean, Weather man was off, but it was good. Fishing. I was just getting ready to say, man, when we left this harbor a little while ago, the sun was shining, no problem getting the drone up, coming down the harbor, showing the beautiful sky over the ocean. The ocean City looked great, and then like two hours into it, yeah. we go up to the, the Route 90 bridge and come back into like a three foot chop with a south wind at like 20 plus dude, miles was, an hour. It was cranking. That sucked. Um, thankfully, spots we were fishing were blocked by the wind, yep. uh, so didn't really have to deal much there. A little bit of that, you know, kind of with the spot lock you have on your uh, trolling motor, got a little bit of that swing when it yep. comes to it when you get caught in the current or something, uh, but that's, that's easy to deal with. 
Yeah. Yeah, real easy to deal with. Better than an anchor. Better than an anchor. I cannot wait for mine, man. I'm yeah. gonna, I got one coming from uh, Midshore Electronics, and Ben and Michael have been doing great, uh, done a great job putting me in the right, you know, piece of equipment. Uh, just hasn't come in yet. Everybody's experiencing these delays with, um, you know, COVID-related, yeah. um, you know, shipping uh, delays. But I'll get it soon enough. I cool, think they man. said sometime late April, or early May. Uh, but some really good fishing, man. Good. Nice fishing with you again, as always. Yeah. Um, Keep pouring them tall jigs. Yeah, Keep man. pouring them bingham jigs. Yeah. They're doing really good. Appreciate Blake it. is Gunther and Sons fishing. So if you follow us on Instagram, Facebook, and stuff, Blake is Gunther and Sons fishing, and just for the fluke of it, right? Just for the Actually, fluke. Is of that it. your private stuff? Or you are yeah, yeah it kind of faded that one out. That's all right. Just yeah. so Gunther and Sons fishing on Instagram and Facebook, and we are obviously hooked on OC on Instagram and Facebook. I fish in OC for uh, Instagram for me, and fish in OC on Facebook. Follow that stuff. We appreciate it very much. And if you need those tall jigs, trust me, if you haven't used a tall jig before, you're going to want to try one. You can absolutely feel every single nibble. Um, you don't get stuck in the bottom as much as you do with those big sinkers. So if you haven't used one, give it a shot and you'll probably switch over just like I have. Um, anything else for the lovely people? Dude, I mean, they catch more than just tall. They catch more than just tall. I got a, I got a scab on my finger from last week to prove it. Yeah. Um, great fishing with you again, brother. Yeah, always fun. Tell the family I said hello. Will. Um, congratulations on the first goal for the kid. Did, awesome yeah. stuff. And folks, we will see you next time for another edition of the show. We got all kinds of things coming up. Flounder fishing in Watch Creek, Virginia. Flounder fishing up here. Stripers are still biting out here. And the party boats are all starting to gear up, getting ready to head off for some sea bass and stuff where the season has changed. More about that later. Thanks very much for watching. We'll see you next time.